What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another one of my videos. Um, as you can tell by the title, this is not a video or like kind of video that I normally do. I normally stick to daily vlogs, but if you've been following my daily vlogs, you know that I am like deep into prep right now. And the prep feels are definitely starting to um, weasel their way in. So I thought instead of including this little try on in one of those daily vlogs that I would make it its own separate video and give myself an extra video to post maybe if there's a day close to show day that I don't feel like editing or anything then I have this and I did realize I made another purchase a little bit ago and never showed you guys those items so today's just going to be a fun video a clothing haul swimsuit haul and they're, they're all spring stuff like the swimsuits are obviously for summer and then I got a few things from Abercrombie that are cute so welcome to my first like full try on I guess mine is the Petula Every other try on I have is Petula. So this is like actual, some of them are real clothes. What, I even, I have a pair of jeans, crazy. So we're gonna get right on into it. We will start with the three items I got from Abercrombie, definitely not anything like crazy. I, this isn't like a huge clothing haul, but I figured I would show you guys because, because. First item up is this very cute, off the shoulder knit sweater. And it was originally 44 bucks and on sale for 22, so like I'll take it. That's a win for me. So it's tapered a little bit, not significantly, but enough to where it lays really, really cute. At least I think so. I generally love off the shoulder stuff and anything soft. And this is super, super soft. Sorry, if you hear a bag moving like a crinkling of a bag, it's my cat with it but very cute off the shoulder super 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 soft so I got it in this heathered gray color as well as this is the other color I got this one is a size small the gray is a medium I would have preferred the medium um, just because I like things being a little bit bigger to start with because generally things shrink and I have very long arms and I'm obviously not going to stay this tiny for a while or I'm not going to stay this tiny forever and I want these to fit so this is a size small I'm just not going to dry it at all but I still think it fits very very well very soft very comfy very cute this is stuff too like I generally you'll notice about me um if I'm not in workout clothes and like I'm actually dressed up. It's stuff that is very comfy like this. Like you could wear it to bed. So those are the two tops I got. Um, and then I got jeans. So I'll move you guys down so you can see the jeans. These are the jeans I got from Abercrombie. They were a little bit more expensive than I wanted them to be. I thought everything was on sale, but it ended up like the jeans weren't on sale or these were one of this. Lily, stop playing in the bag. Now, this is what she's playing with. But yeah, so anyway, they were not on sale. They were $78, but they actually fit really well. Like the, they're high rise, but not, well, I guess not even really. No, they're not. Did I just lie? Well, just kidding. They're low rise. Okay, I haven't had a pair of low rise jeans in a long time, but most jeans um, honestly hit me lower than this because I just have a very long torso. So. They fit really, really well though. The length is good on me. I don't know if they're, I'm assuming they're supposed to be like full length. They hit me more like a 7 8 which I don't have a problem with, but they're very stretchy. I can move very easily and I just needed a pair of dark wash jeans. So that's, these are the pair I got. I'm hoping with my off season, with how I plan to stay on off season or in my off season, I'm hoping these will continue to fit me. But if not, I have other jeans that fit me. I just have zero that fit me during this prep and um, I am doing a way longer prep this year so I needed something, something to wear. But these are the ones I got and I'm happy with my purchase. So these are once again, the Harper low rise jeans. Now it's time for the bikinis, the fun part, because I don't like jeans. Bikini number one, 
is, is the one I have on right now. Um, I did get everything in a size medium. The smalls fit me right now, but I know they wouldn't have fit as soon as I put on like five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven pounds. So um, I got everything in medium. They still fit, like they stay up well, obviously, wouldn't want them falling down, but um, keep that in mind. There is a little bit of extra room in some of the bottoms, I think, in the back right now, just because I'm the tiniest I've ever been because of competing, but this is suit number one. I love this one. So, oh, also, <laughs> don't mind my little <laughs> sweat bumps they have going on right there because, you know, I'm human and doing cardio and working out. <sighs> and this little guy showed up the other day, cool. This is bikini number one. All of the bikinis I got are from Airy. They're all from Airy. And I wanna say the bottoms are like 20 some bucks. It has this nice little, whoops, tags hanging out. So this one has this fun little top up here. There's double strings up on the back. And I just, I like this pattern a lot. Nice and neutral. So yeah, this one actually matches. Um, all of the other ones I got are more like mismatch. But I like the size of these bottoms. I'm not a fan of the whole like completely let your bum hang out because like I get enough of that with my competition suit and it's very uncomfortable. So like a lot of the ones from Zoffel, it seems are like a little tinier than I prefer. So these ones I like, they, they're a little cheeky, but nothing like I would be uncomfortable wearing in front of my dad because all of these I'm gonna wear in front of my dad. Up at the lake, <sighs> so excited to be able to go up to the lake. But yes, suit number one is this one. I think it's very cute. I really, all the bottoms I got are the same, but I also got them in this tan color. There is a string on me. Um, I got a bunch of plain colors because it's hard for me, like I said, to find bottoms that fit really well. And I thought these fit the best out of any of the um, bathing suit bottoms I've tried on in a long time. And I like the idea of being able to like mix and match. So these are just a nude color. And I feel like, I don't know, I feel like that works. I did get a top that matches this though. So hold on. Bikini number two. Well, top number two, really. I think the rest are actually just colored bottoms, but this is a top that I would not normally get. Um, I am very much the girl who buys suits based off of like not wanting tan lines. So I've actually never had a high neck um, bikini top before, but I thought this was really cute. Once again, um, when we go up to the lake, which we do plan on being up there a lot this summer, um, we walk around in the middle of the day and like go get food and you know, do all the stuff you would do up at a lake and just enjoy our time. So this would be something I could wear into a little restaurant and not feel weird about it, like just put some shorts on with it. So the back, I can feel the straps are definitely twisted because Christopher isn't here to help me, but it, it kind of, it's adjustable, but when I first put it on, it seemed a little uncomfortable. But I think it's pretty cute. Um, and I also feel like in the summer when you're tan, you don't have to worry about it, like not showing up and you looking like you're naked. But, so that's, this is just like this little knitted area. That's the box. And same thing, these are the same bottoms I had on last time. So this is the other matching set. So these are the two matching suits I got. This nude one, this pink one that I think is super cute. And then I think I just have a bunch of different bottoms. But once again, they fit well. So when you find something that fits well, you get them in every single color. You feel me? These, I must say, I think are one of my favorites. Obviously, they're the same bottoms because they fit really well, like I've said a billion times. But I love this color blue, and this is when I feel like, I, I like this little mitch, miss, miss, match look. And I like these colors together. I just want to have my fun little frozen drink in my hand with a little umbrella in it. 
laying out, getting tan, getting funky tan lines apparently. <laughs> Last but definitely not least, these are the last pair of bikini bottoms I got, but I totally forgot I got three more shirts. <laughs> so I got, I'll put my jeans back on after this and show you those. But I love this, this color as well. It actually matches the other shirt I got from Abercrombie. Once again, nice and plain mismatch look. I feel like I can pair any of these with anything, which makes me super excited because I have a lot of other tops I like, but either the bottoms don't fit the style like and you know when you sit down in the hot tub I have this at lifetime all the time I sit down in the hot tub and then it like the bottom of the suit pulls so a lot of my bottoms tend to go bad before the tops do so now I have all of these and I want to say they were like 20 bucks yeah the bottoms were all $19 so I thought it was a really good deal way better than like Victoria's Secret and yeah I like them I feel like I should be like bikini posing right now. Just kidding. Not that kind of suit, Kelly. Not that kind of suit. So yeah. Those are the bikinis. Um, like I said, I forgot I had other tops. So BRB. <laughs> okay, I actually, as I went to take these off, I realized that they match this top really, really well too. So see, you gotta go with plain bottoms. You need to get stuff that's versatile, can go with whatever you want. At least that's what I do. Yeah, I like this one. That's cute. Okay, now I'll put the jeans back on. Actually, man of the hour, Mr. Christopher bought me the bathing suits. Everything from Aerie he got me for my birthday gift. You liked everything, right? I didn't see that one on yet. That's cute. Yeah, this is just, once again, nice, oversized. I think really freaking cute. Um, per everything, all the purchases I made, I made thinking of going to the lake. And this would be perfect for the lake, wouldn't it? Yeah. Sitting at the fire with my frozen drink with the umbrella in it. So yeah. I asked them if they thought any of this would shrink and they said it's all pre-shrunk. I'm still not gonna dry it, but just cause I always run into a problem with like the sleeves being too short cause my arms are so long. But I love this, nice, comfy, looks cute. You could tie it, I guess, if you wanted to. I would not. <laughs> so it's like this little, I guess, salmon color. I don't know how much this was. Salmon? Not salmon, I guess just nude, sand sand color. This was 34 doll hairs and totally worth it. All right, next item up, which I got in two colors, um, actually a similar color to one of the suits, is this little t-shirt crop top. It has a little knot in it. You don't have to tie it, it's just like, like that. Anyway, so, we learned these are low rise jeans. So if you had high waisted jeans on with them, I guess they, you probably wouldn't show that much of your stomach, but just cute little cropped t-shirt, very thin material. Um, not like see-through by any means, but it's nice and lightweight. So yeah, got this one, the olive green, and then I got this color, which matches, and this one's kind of like uh, yeah, well you can tell. It's like washed almost, like that washed out look. Matches, wow, perfectly. <laughs> the one bottoms I got. Let's see if I can do this. I don't ever do cool transitions, but like, voila. This is the other one. If there's a sticker on here, uh, I apologize, I can't find it. <laughs> I don't think there is. So this is just the other one, exact same fit. These are a size small, and I got this sweatshirt in a small as well. Uh, cause they said everything was pre-shrunk. So that's what I got. That is my little clothing haul. All of this should fit me when I put a little LBs back on after I'm done competing. But very, very, very happy with all of my purchases. Um, I haven't bought new bikinis in quite a while, so those are going to last me for a long time. And like I said, we're planning on going up to the lake as much as possible this um, this weekend, I wish, um, <laughs> this summer. 
So those are gonna go to fantastic use and I'm glad I got these three bottoms. Obviously the one's a pattern, but they're nice to mix, ma miss, match. I can't say that. Does anyone else get tired trying clothes on and off and taking them on and off? Cause I do. <laughs> That is it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this different kind of video in a little try on. I know I enjoyed it because I don't normally shop for clothes other than workout clothes. So I'm very, very, very excited to have the new bikinis to go to the lake in and enjoy. And just thinking about going to the lake makes me so happy right now, but we're not there yet. Got to get through the competition season and it needs to warm up outside because we got the sunshine going on, but not quite quite the temperatures yet. So if you did enjoy the video, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. If you aren't subscribed, join the family. We just keep growing each and every day. It's so exciting. Um, if you don't normally watch my daily vlogs, maybe check those out right now. I am currently going through a bikini prep. So I already competed at the Arnold. Um, by the time you're seeing this, I'm about to compete in my second show. It's a week away from yesterday. No, from today. Yeah, no, I'm six days out, at least from today. So by the time you're seeing this, I'm probably like maybe four, three days out. I don't know, something like that. But yeah, check those videos out if you haven't. And I will see you guys tomorrow for a vlog, probably, because that's what I do. I am only cool. I am only cool.